don't feel like I was given a great deal of natural talent. I just fell in love with that feeling of surfing big waves. It gets so addictive. Travelling and chasing swells to remote parts of the world and surfing with only, you know, a handful of guys that are your best mates and stuff, it's like the best feeling ever. He's done it since he was a little kid and it's all he ever wanted to do was to surf and then later he just realised, you know, in order to keep surfing, he had to make a living out of it and that is what he did. So this thing's got me through like barrels from 12 feet up to like 25 feet. I feel like the luck's run out on it and just it made too many good barrels in a row. So. Everyone has limits, but whether you're breaking those limits, you're breaking those boundaries, you're pushing through them, that's what Mark does. When someone asks me what Mark is like, I immediately think calm. very hard to see him go down a big wave but at the same time he's always come up and it teaches him too that whatever he does he will come up again. You can't interfere with somebody's life or with somebody's dreams and uh, what brings them the greatest joys. It's his dream, not only his dream, it's his whole life. Yeah, I think for me Surfing and riding big waves is like the best vehicle to get in that space where I'm really focused and I'm in the moment and there's no other dramas going on. It's, it's the easiest way for me to get there.